Yeah. It's very sad, of course. Um, and obviously, I wish that Megan could have experienced um, Fashion Week this year. Megan Nespliak, a 22 year old fashion influencer from Edmonton, was diagnosed with a terminal stomach cancer in March 2022. She passed in early September, but her legacy lives on this week. This past summer, the 22 year old canceled plans to attend New York Fashion Week as her health failed. But the cancer patient turned lemons into lemonade through Megan Fashion Week. It's gonna be a virtual fashion week that anyone and everyone can participate in and I am going to be raising money for stomach cancer research because that is the type of cancer that I have. In honor of her 22 years of life, Megan created 22 fashion themes for her followers to create outfits for and encouraged them to share pictures to social media from September 21st to 25th, tagging hashtag Megan Fashion Week. She also started a fundraiser for the Canadian Cancer Society with a goal of $250,000. Instagram users from all over Alberta and across the world have participated in Megan Fashion Week, all showing their support for Megan and her fight against cancer, including this model living in Tennessee. I just thought it was a really fun dress uh, that Megan would have liked because it was a bedazzled, juicy couture dress. Um, so I feel like it was something fun um, to honor her with. Ali Musella says Megan's efforts in raising awareness for cancer in the social media fashion community is special and rare. I've never seen fashion and uh, cancer related, um, which is awesome. I think that obviously there is awareness that needs to go into that. Um, and I think that it's really powerful that uh, Megan being so into fashion could impact um, and bring together so many people. Megan Fashion Week runs until September 25th and more info on how you can donate can be found on the Instagram account at Megan Fashion Week. Back in August, Megan shared on her TikTok something she's learned through her cancer journey. Appreciate what you have, even if you don't think you have a lot. If you have your health and at least one person you love, even if the person's a dog, <laughs> you're very lucky. In Edmonton, Sarah Chu, City News.